Today says Kiara, I walk by faith and keep going, always ready for God. Uh, Rebecca says, yes, the enemy will always try to bring someone something from your past and he can't stop you. He tries to keep you from moving. Amen. We rebuke the devourer. We rebuke that in the name of Jesus. Sweet and fierce says, what is this young brother's name? <laughs> and Maricelia says, power fam. You guys can see it. We're, it's, it's at the bottom, the bottom of the screen. You guys can see his name. Um, everyone's like, yes, yes, yes. Praise God. Bring him on. <laughs> yeah. So we'll, we'll do more of these sessions. You know, this channel is more to just to glorify God. It's not about me. It's really, it, it's never been about me. It's always been about Jesus. So just bringing some people as the Lord leads. Okay. I was the one that reached out. God's the one that touched my heart. Power didn't say, Hey, can I come on live with you? He was just like, wow, praise Jesus. And if you guys can stay humble, if you guys can just allow prayer to work, if you can just allow God to position you, let the Lord touch the hearts of those that hear from God. So guys, we're going to end it. You know, this is our power hour. We're about to actually hit the hour, um, which God is just good. I mean, we, we could go on all night. We could talk about the Lord for hours. We'll probably go on another night. It's, you know, it's a little bit later here. I got some things to do. I know power. He's got some rest as well. So what I'm going to do is if you guys have any prayer requests, um, Maricela just said, I'll, the only prayer request I saw was, hey, pray that these witches leave me alone. They don't even pay rent, yet they be having parties in my living room. <laughs> so uh, Maricela, she's the one that's from our Bible study. So definitely, sister. I know that you are uh, you told me, you I saw your message earlier, you said you'll be on. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have, I'm actually going to have power uh, to be able to pray us out tonight. And if y'all are ready for like a prayer, you know, all through the Holy Ghost, just say you receive it. Let the Lord speak to you. And I'm just going to have power close out in prayer. And we're going to call it. You guys love, love this stuff. Thank you for the thumbs up. Really shows a lot of the support for the channel. Also, if you guys like the stuff, you guys can subscribe. Tap the notification bell. We're always dropping stuff. I want to bring on more young people. Doesn't matter. You could, be, you could be growing up. I don't believe in growing old. I believe in growing up. You could be double my age, double our age, right? I, I'm double power's age. He could live a whole nother lifetime and finally hit my age. Like this is the fire of God that is upon all flesh. Those that are willing to be used. Those are willing for the spirit of revival to stir up in your spirit. All right. So power, um, people, are, uh, daughter of the most, I says, Hey, pray for my finances. Rebecca says you're chosen when you take it, the calling. Amen. Mariah says, where are you guys at? It's 12 where I am. Um, I'm in, I'm in Nevada. I'm in Vegas. Power is in Arizona. So we're not too far from each other. So we're on Pacific standard time. Sophia says, I need revived spirit. I want to begin my calling with God. Praise God, Sophia. God didn't bring you here by accident. That's pretty much what this channel is about is raising up some people that are literally ready, ready to take the calling, ready to just hear from God. And it, it might not be from me. It might be just the spirit of God just flowing and speaking through anybody, any vessel that we bring on this channel. However God does it, it might be through somebody else, whatever. But let God use you. Let the Lord use you for what you were called for in Jesus' name. So, Power, I'm going to have you close out, and let's make this happen. Let's make this happen. Praise the Lord. I thank everyone uh, uh, who tuned in. And I, I just want to say this. Me and R.C., we're just people who God wants to use. We're people who God wants to use and God wants to use you. We need to be humble. We need to be humble. We are nothing without God. I, I, I consider myself nothing without the Lord Jesus. Nothing. I don't consider myself better than anyone. Not better than anyone. But yes, let's pray. Let's pray. Uh, I, people need prayer. We need prayer. Prayer is powerful, especially prayers of faith. We need prayers of faith. All right. You you ready, RC, our brother? Ready? Okay. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Father, right now, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for everyone who is on this life. I thank you that your spirit moved in this life. I pray in the name of Jesus that we will be full of faith and power, like how Stephen was in the book of Acts, that you would use us mightily. Oh, God, to light a fire within us like never before, to be used by you, to get in the things of God, to get in the secret place, to seek your face, to seek after your heart. Huh? 
I pray that every dry bone by the life that the Holy Spirit gives will be revived, will be resurrected by the Holy Spirit. Oh God, let the floodgates of heaven open. Just flood us with life and life more abundantly. Just flood us with the presence and the power of God. Just flood us with your love. I pray in the name of Jesus that you fill us up with the love of God, that your love will wrap around our heart like tight chains and that the peace of God will keep our hearts, that the peace of God will just dominate and rule within our heart. Help us to walk through the valley of the shadow of death, not sit in the valley of the shadow of death, but walk through the valley of the shadow of death to have the faith to walk through. Help us to walk by faith. Help us to lock our minds and our hearts and our eyes on the word, on the promises of God. David saw your promises. David knew that you were never going to leave him or forsake him. And I pray that whatever assignment that you have assigned us to do, all for your glory and for our and for your kingdom, that it will be done, that we would have the faith to go forth and to preach your word and to lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. And if it be your will, then to do deliverance on people, to preach your word in the name of Jesus. Right now, every satanic entity that is looking to come against the people that are on this life, you demonic entities, I come against you right now in the name of Jesus. I stand in my position of authority, seated with the Lord Jesus Christ in the highest of the heavenlies, according to Romans chapter 16, verse 20. Satan, you are under my feet. Your principalities are under my feet in the name of Jesus. Right now, you demonic entities, I am coming against. I bind you in Jesus' name. I release the fire of God to consume you now. I may you be melted by fire. May you be roasted by fire. Let every part of you be melted. I release the thunderbolts of God to land upon your head in the name of Jesus. I release right now the arrows of the Lord God dipped in the blood of Jesus to rain down and impel you now. I release the blood of Jesus to break your back and to paralyze you in Jesus' mighty name. Right now, I declare that no weapon formed against you shall prosper. I decree that whatever whatever situation that you are in, but that by the power of God, God will deliver you in the name of Jesus according to his perfect timing in the name of Jesus. Lord, help us to have that faith that whatever wilderness of problems we're in, that let us have the faith that you will deliver us from whatever problem we're in. In the name of Jesus, I cover and saturate everyone on this life, everyone under the sun, under everyone under the sound of my voice. I saturate them in the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. I speak life over everyone under the sound of my voice. I speak the blessings of heaven over you now. Let your head be a landing pad for the blessings of heaven. Let your life be a landing zone for the blessings of God in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray in Jesus' name that our trust will abound in you, O Lord, that we will not be distracted by the distractions of the enemy, but that we'll be focused on you, Lord Jesus. Let our minds be anchored by the things of the Spirit. Let us be hungry and thirsty for righteousness sake. According to your word, those people shall be filled. Lord, we want to be filled. We want to be filled with the fire of God. We want to be filled with your power. We want to be filled with your anointing, with your love, with your peace. Fill us up, oh God. Just fill us up in the name of Jesus. And I pray that we would all clo- wrap around ourselves in the clothes, in the clothes of humility. We would humble ourselves under your mighty hand in the name of Jesus. May your will be done in our lives. In Jesus name. Thank you, Lord. I give you the glory. I give you the praise. I give you the honor. Lord, all I give you all the glory. We are nothing without you, Lord. I give you all the all the glory, all the praise, all the honor. I cover everyone under the sound of my voice in the blood of Jesus. In Jesus name. Amen. Praise of the Lord. Hallelujah. Wow. Just feel the peace. Y'all feel the peace of God? <laughs>